What's up, my Leo gang, gang, gang? We're going to be doing a general reading for you all for the week. All right. Let's start off with some tarot. Sorry, I had to adjust the camera a little bit. My bad, yeah. Y'all lying, y'all, man. Y'all don't jump on me, okay? I'm just messing with y'all. I flex with y'all, though. I get along with you guys. I'm the greatest. Y'all cool people. Y'all cool with me. I'll be doing more readings for y'all. Because I know that y'all like to see y'all readings a little bit more often. Just wait. All right, energy is the ten of swords. Ooh, feels like breakdown, mental breakdown, ruin, it's failure, bitterness, exhaustion, collapse, betrayal, and deep wounds. Ten of wands. Coming in your past energy, you got the six of wands, and that talks about failure. Again, lack of recognition, no rewards, no achievements, um, like like falling from grace, you know, like, you know, conceit, conceitment, feeling conceited, you know, disappointments all together. Ugh, past energy, good. All right, in your current energy, you got the three of cups. And that is cancer energy. And that speaks about feeling delightful, celebrations, parties, gatherings, social events, and friendships. Okay? That's good energy. Love it, Leah. In your future energy, you got the devil. That talks about addictions, materialism, being trapped in bondage, you know, dependency, you know, um, discontentment, excess, um, like powerless, things like that. Limitations, you know, feeling limited in life. And that's in your future energy if you don't change it. Everybody has the ultimate choice to change their outcome. Okay? We just get some cards here just to give you your options. This is a reading. This is not the outcome of your life. You're using this for your life purpose. I'm going to need you to go see a therapist or a counselor. That's not what tarot is for. So I was just to give you a general idea of the energy of the collective. Unless we're doing a personal reading. Okay. And I don't think that y'all Leo's out there doing any, anything like that. So I just wanted to say that, but I don't feel it. I don't feel energy out there. Maybe a few of you, very few, very few. Please seek counseling. It's definitely worth it. I've gone through some several times. It's called healing. Get you some. It's definitely worth it. All right, let's see what comes up, guys. Let's get some clarifiers. My Leo gang gang. I'm going to do two for each position. Maybe two outcomes. Two alternatives, shall I say. Okay. All right, energy, ten of wands, again. What's going on? Ten of swords and ten of wands. When this comes out, it talks about collapse, breakdown, too much responsibility, learning to say no. That's why I wanted to clarify, but it seems like I'm pulling the same energy. Well, swords and wands is a little bit different, but not much when you're dealing with the ten. So, um, coming in your past position, you've got the strength card in the reverse. That deals about self-doubt, weakness, imbalance, you know, feeling discord and being manipulative or either manipulated. Okay, that's coming in your past energy. Or else you had the page of pentacles, which is ambitious, um, studious, consistent, you know, being a planner, um, well-grounded, you know, and pentacles always talks about money. So with pentacles, if you were like lacking 
or lack thereof, it's definitely coming because you have the, the pentacles coming in. It's in a reverse in your current position, but it's the two of pentacles. So it speaks about unbalance, You're feeling overwhelmed, like chaos, you know, being disorganized. So get yourself organized, un overwhelmed, unchaotic, and get some, find some balance. Find some balance in your life. Because the um the swords, that ten of swords, as we know that you need to find balance in your life. That's what that talks about. And it deals with water elements, which is Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Okay? And that's your current energy for that. Then you have the three of wands that's coming in in the reverse as well. And that speaks about restrictions, limitations, obstacles, delays, and frustration. Because if you have an all this, of course, you're going to feel all this. And the frustration and delays and all that. So, you do have the ability to change all of it. As it says here, sudden change, speed quick decisions, excitement, and that's coming in your future energy. I'm feeling that now, Leos. I'm feeling that energy now. Y'all may already be experiencing it as well. Deceit, theft with the seven of swords coming in in that right position, two-faced, spine, and being manipulated, and manipulation again. So you got the strength card that's talking about manipulation, and you got the the Seven of Swords that's kept talking about manipulation as well. So, someone definitely needs to cleanse their energy. Let's work on that, okay? Leos. We don't want that type of energy. But I don't feel it. Like I said, I'm feeling... I feel very content right now. I feel a lot of contentment. Let's get some career money. Let's see what's going on in career money. TikTok as well. I will be on Instagram next week. And if you would like to book a personal reading or anything, just let me know. My information is in, in, the, in the bottom. Just go to my page and let me know. Let's see what comes out here, guys. Wow. Got two off the break. I'm going to put those back in. Actually, I'm going to keep them. But we still going to get two more. career and finance for y'all, Leo. I got job loss, termination of employment. Got overtime. Got follow-up. Got unemployment. That reminds me of the job loss. Got overspending. Creativity. And interview. Awesome. So all that that's leads up to this interview. This job loss, the unemployment, now you're gonna get your job. I felt that already before I started reading before I started the reading. Somebody's getting a six-figure job coming in either the, the, right before Christmas or right after, right before the full, New Year. Somebody's going to hear something. Six figures, congratulations. Congratulations, Leo. Let's get some messages from the universe and see what Spirit has to say. 
We're gonna get some numbers and places three tonight, okay? Mercury retrograde. Is anybody else feeling this? I am. Definitely. Okay. I can talk half the time. My technology is after night. Caution. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. That may be what you did. And cause yourself job loss. Because that's what I'm feeling. Let go. Make room for the new beginnings on its way to you. There's Mercury retrograde, electronic issues, communication issues. Review everything. You hear me? Please do. I'm feeling this card very, very strongly all week long and last week. And they'll be back. I expect to hear from them soon. Okay. That will be the end of your reading, Leo. My line is out there. Y'all have a wonderful evening and enjoy the rest of your week. Like, please like, share, and subscribe.